Blitz fans, this is There Can Be Only One coming back in uh, <clears throat> another video, okay? So, I did get the, um, I guess the steer, WT tank, uh, cost me quite a bit of uh, credits to actually get it because <clears throat> my life is so busy and stuff. I don't really get to play the game as much as I used to. I work a lot. I have other things I have to take care of, so... You know, I grinded as much as I could, and then right before it ended, um, I went ahead and paid the credits. Luckily, I saved up, you know, um, something like 42 million credits um, so that I could get this tank. And uh, I'm not really too impressed. It's it's a good tank. It's kind of it's kind of like the uh, oh, what's it? The SU the SU uh, um, oh, I can't think of the name. It Jesus. Um, so it's kind of like the Scorpion and the and the other uh, TD at uh, Tier Seven, but the gun is really good. I'm really loving this gun. This gun is it, it, it can do a lot of damage in the right position, but because she has such low hit points, such low armor. I mean, you're only sitting on a thousand hit points, and everybody wants to shoot you and hit you with HE. You know, three shots, you're gone. So you can't really afford to make mistakes. And I'm gonna go perch up on this ridge right here because why not? And what we got here, someone that spot up the dreadnought. Let's go ahead and sink some shots into him. Uh, that tank uh, can actually do a lot of damage to me uh, if he has spotted me. Now that's another thing I noticed about this tank is like the uh, the camouflage is really good. Uh, so, you know, you can look at stats all the time, but stats are kind of iffy in a way when you start playing the tank and stuff. So I really don't care too much about stats. I don't really get into it because, you know, it doesn't really tell you how this tank plays or any tank, you know. So, that, you know, it gives you a, a basis idea of how it should, but how it really does in the game is it's not that great. And this is something I can't stand. That Smasher had to sit there and pull all the way up. What, what if they had pulled out and be able to shoot from, from my, uh, shooting my side because I can't back up? You know, players just don't pay attention. And I did look at his stats afterwards. He's not a bad player. He definitely a reroll, but still not a bad player. You know, he should know better than to get behind people and teammates and stuff where they can't take cover. That's one of my most pet peeves. So, um, and I'm, I'm looking for this KB3. You know, he's down here. He's after me. Oh, there he is. And he misses and so he expected me to be still driving forward and I backed up did a little juke and uh, we're gonna sink another shot into him and, and uh, kill his engine so this guy's not like the greatest of players um, he's trying to go after what he thinks is the easy kill and I'm gonna play a little bit of a cat and mouse game at this point because hey buddy want to come here I said I track you I track you now you can't drive I'm gonna go ahead and take the shot because we're down to um, you know uh, two red so I'm not too worried about you know losing a little bit of HP but as you can see he's like he knocked me for 400 that's a third of my HP right there doesn't take very much and there's the smasher that's that's the one I did not want to get hit by because he would have dirt me on out most definitely Just track him keep him from running away so I can put that last shot in and then my teammates go ahead and finish them off what a beautiful game that was um, so you can have really good games in this tank um, it's it definitely has a good gun uh, it's just you know you can you can easily get like um, wrecked and stuff and at the beginning you know I kind of have a little um, back and forth with this guy this T uh, uh, T44 85 just sniping your gun mounts okay don't even know what that means um, Gave him a lucky player and all that good stuff because at the beginning I said something about you know about you know the players and stuff and and you can always tell like the idiots on your team because they'll they'll be they'll be the first one to respond even though I'm saying something that's not even directed at them they will take it personally and and, and say something and automatically I can tell I can't depend on them. I, I'm not going to worry about them. I'm going to, I'm going to, you know, work with the rest of the team. Um, so, and we're going to take a look at him. I mean, he's definitely a reroll. 
you know, 7,000 battles, uh, 56. Uh, 0.95 so just up under 57 83 um, accuracy average damage is 14 this is how I can tell it's a reroll because at this 1448 damage means like he knows how to shoot and he's only got 7,000 battles um, and then we can actually go and take another look at his stats and you can see mostly high tier mostly high tier okay so you know you can read this and tell who's a reroll you know people think like if they reroll no one can tell of course they can tell because if you're a spirits player rerolling it's going to show up in your stats well anyways this is um this is it for this video um this is there can be only one sign out please remember to like subscribe and share remember stay safe out there and happy hunting